morning. It's springtime. So springtime, we think of as cleansing. Uh, maybe you clean your closets up, maybe you clean up drawers, different things like that. But today, um, so that's always great, I'm gonna do that. Um, today, we are going to be talking about cleansing. And we'll be talking a little bit more about the liver today than other uh, organs. So to start with, I just want you to find your breath. That's a great way to begin cleansing. So you can sit on your heels, you can sit on a blanket, you can sit on a pillow, but just find a way that you can sit that you create some space in your ribs and your shoulders drop down. So think of you know, your lungs and think of lifting your lungs. And take a few breaths, inhale through your nose, exhale through your nose. As you inhale, feel your shoulders drop. And exhale. Now as you inhale, imagine creating space in the ribs, shoulders still face to drop. And exhale. Stay with your breath and move through and reflect on what's happening inside your body. No screaming only today. some poses that are great for springtime. We're going to work with those today. We want to feel like we're getting space in the body, working with the breath to cleanse. And then the next time that you exhale, take your hands onto your knees and you're going to inhale forward and exhale full way back. And as you inhale forward on your right side, which is going to look like the left when you're looking at the camera. Think of on the right side, to so your sternum, to the bottom right ribs area. Pulling in, giving that liver a little squeeze, then stretching forward and pulling back. And stretching forward. And start to notice, if you can, some movement inside your body. So maybe start with the area that you are familiar with, which is your spine. So when I pull back, I feel the bones of my spine push back. Then take the front, the inside of the spine, and take it forward. Think of that moving the organs and glands and push back. Three more. Soothing yourself. Last one. And then coming up. So working with our core is a great way to start to ignite and uh, stimulate and cleanse our organs and our glands inside our body. So what you'll do is you'll come down. Take your hands underneath your hamstrings. Let your Organs pull into the back body, draw back, and the same thing, inhale, lift up. I let my elbows go out as I draw back. Pull your elbows in as you lift up. Moving from the inside. Last two. your legs extend. Let your chin stay tucked. From here, let your head come down. Sweep your legs over your head. Bend your knees. Take a twist. Take the legs over your head. Bend your knees. Take a twist. Straighten legs over the head. Bend your knees. Take a twist. As you do this, Think inside your body, you are turning your organs and glands upside down, and then getting a twist. One more. 
inside. And slowly let your back body come down, bend your knees, lift up bridge pose. As you lift up into bridge pose, bring both hands onto your right for my ribs, bottom ribs. Uh, maybe my left palm will be on my sternum, the bottom tip there. And then take your hand along that and imagine underneath there, inside your body, your liver. Uh, it's the largest gland in the body, I believe. Cleanses the blood. Lift it a little higher. One more breath. Inhale, feel those ribs move. Slowly come down. And to come down on your left side. If you have a strap or a tie or something, go ahead and grab that now. And place it around my right foot. So most of the liver is on the right side. So I'm letting it kind of dangle down. I would suggest coming down, otherwise that's kind of creepy. So from here, if you can hold on to your toe, that's fine. If not, don't worry about it. And from here, you're gonna pull your belly button in, in, in. Like somebody's punching you in the belly button. Pull in, in, in. If you're gonna use your breath, it'll be F stand. Exhale. 
exhale. Inhale, take the bottom ribs in and lift them up on the back body. Think of taking your glands and your organs for a ride here. Remember, you're either here or you're in downward dog. Find whatever breath as you feel like as you lift up downward dog. Pull your organs and glands way in. Maybe you can suck your belly in for today. And then as you come forward, create space. One more. Everybody meets up. Knees are down. Push back child's pose. So moving out of winter into spring, kind of a sense of growth, sense of expansion, sense of newness. Then make your baby up to seated. So twist, going back into some pretty deep twists. You can sit on the edge of a blanket, have your blocks handy. So twisting, we're doing it from the torso. And sometimes people do it from the shoulders, which isn't bad, but it's really not what we're working on today. So as I'm sitting on the edge of these blankets, I'm gonna pull, I'm not gonna mirror you, my right knee in, pull your heel close to your sit bone, and then take your left arm forward and reach it way forward. And first let's open up the hip joint. So you're gonna be like sawing forward and back. Let this right hip joint start to relax. Once you feel like your low back feels a little bit more fluid and your hip joint's kind of more relaxed. From here, take your right hand back, lean back on your shoulders, left arm reaches up and then cross it over the midline. Now listen carefully. Here's where some of us will feel like, okay, I'm doing a twist. Not so much. So from here, I'm gonna use my right hand to push me forward, take a block behind you, and then twist the organs and the glands. So I'm twisting my organs and glands to the right. Breath is gonna be a little shorter. Use this right knee to kind of push you around. Shoulders drop down, lift your lungs up. Pull the right ribs in. Lift forward, don't push back. And then release that out. So think of squeezing a towel or squeezing a rag when you did that twist and you kind of got some uh, toxins Squeeze them and then go ahead and let your body now breathe. And second side. We'll do that saw to begin with to release your hip joint. See if your little back, how your little back feels about this. Thank you. And then reach back, left hand back. Lean back, so you create some space in your torso. Reach your right arm up, and then as you come forward, cross it over the midline. So think of your shoulders, I have a block underneath my left hand. As you think of your shoulders, trying to go over your hips, and then twist your organs and glands around. So go from inside the body. Here's me twisting from my shoulders, Here's me lengthening and then going from my organs. Use your knee to help you get around. Shoulders down, lift your lungs. And 
and then inhale. So think of that squeezing, maybe squeeze out there. Now inhale, take some breath in. And transition to a couple of standing poses that are standing twists. Stepping my right leg forward, left heel back, square your pelvis round. Walk your blocks forward and then give some space in your body to get space for the organs and glands. Then this twist is not going to come from your hips moving because we really want to help the organs and glands twist so that we get old toxins out. Springtime, we're gonna clean. You can walk the block under your left hand in the midline. And then think of your left ribs drawing under as your right ribs lift up and back. Stay with that breath. Inhale, exhale through nose. And then change sides. So twists are great for your nervous system as well. But for today, focus yourself. You're, you're going to feel a lot calmer after this class because it's going to help your liver be uh, operating better, which is going to help your cortisol level. There's like the whole, look it up, go YouTube it. What does the liver do? And you'll get lots of great information for your health and well-being. So I'm going to create space in the front of my body and my organs and glands. Take the block in the midline. My pelvis is going to stay squared as possible. Hope I can do it. Take the bottom ribs underneath you. Top ribs, draw them down and back. right side, spinning on your heels, back knee comes down, inhale, reach up, exhale, twist over, inhale, reach up, think of your organs and glands, you're twisting here, two more, inhale, exhale, last one, inhale, create space, Exhale, hands come down on the inside. 
back, knee goes back, and you can come down on your elbows. Do so, maybe you have a block underneath your elbows. Let your kidneys lift slightly, they're at the bottom of the back ribs. Give your liver a little hug, pull it in.
one minute here. Stay there longer than one minute if you like. At one minute, I'm gonna end the class. Think of staying planted. Think of the natural properties of growth coming from patience, faith, trust, to transition your way to seated, feel free to do so. Otherwise, stay where you are. Draw your hands together in front of your heart. Think of lifting your heart, sending your chin 